This is going to be a quick and efficient way to both strengthen and assess a bunch of different positions for your shoulders. And all you need is a dowel rod or a broomstick uh, or even a bat or something you can grip tightly and try to break without it actually breaking. So we're going to start off, grip tightly at about shoulder width apart, and you're going to press the rod into your thighs. So you're going to press into your thighs with a tight grip and it's going to engage some stuff. Glutes tight too. And then you're going to try to break the dowel rod. All right, break it, press in, keep that tension. Keep a really tight squeeze of your fist and try to maintain all of this tension as you slowly bring this up towards flexion. All right, so elbows are staying straight. We're bringing it slowly up and you're just observing what's going on. See how you feel in each position. See if you feel really strong, if you can keep your tension or if you struggle with tension in some positions. All right, you're coming up towards flexion and you're gonna to try to keep your midsection, your trunk engaged, and your ribs down so that doesn't happen, okay? For me, with my left shoulder especially, I can't get too far. And then you're gonna slowly, very slowly, bring it back down. Still observing. On the way down, it might actually feel a little bit different than on the way up. So just observe what's going on. I'd even recommend that you film this so you can see what's going on. I think I got a little bit of a tilt because I tend to do that, I'm a little bit asymmetrical, which is not anything to be really worried about. All right, so that probably got some stuff fired up. Now we can try it with the hands a little bit wider, and we can also try with different grips. So I'd encourage you to experiment with different whips, different grips, excuse me. All right, same deal, press in, try to break this. You're bringing the arms slowly up, and just observing, see what you feel. This supinated palms up position is going to feel different. Your range of motion is probably going to change. Elbows straight. There we go. And you're slowly bringing it down. Good. Pressing into your thighs again. All right. Now you can do the same thing before extension. So we're going to grip just like this. All right. Press into your hamstrings. Try to break this and you're going to pull, 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 pull back. All right, I want you to think about pulling your palms towards the sky and pull the top of your head towards the sky. So they're both up, 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 up. You're staying tall, chest up, without this happening, right? Palms and top of the head towards the sky. Now you're slowly bringing it back down, pressing in. All right. Then you can try different grip, different width, and it'll be a little bit of a different experience. Again, you're just experimenting here. See what you're feeling. And if you notice specific angles, specific grips, where you feel like, you know what, I could be a little stronger there, or that didn't feel great, that felt a little unstable. Now you have an idea of where you can work. All right, we've identified some priorities and really efficiently strengthened and activated stuff in a whole bunch of different positions. So, hope you enjoyed it. Experiment.